Waiting for Chicken Smith by David McIntosh. I'm waiting for Chicken Smith. He, he won't be long now. Every year, I stay at the same cabin at the beach with my family. And every year, Chicken Smith is here with his dad and his dog, Jelly. Chicken Smith knows the beach like the back of his hand. And I do, too. Hey, look, my sister calls. But I'm waiting for Chicken Smith. He should be here soon. Every year, Chicken Smith Spike sits on his porch with his dad's surfboard and the buoy we found in the dunes. Chicken's bedroom window is at the front, and we use it like a door. Chicken Smith can kick a tennis ball from the top step onto the beach, and Jelly will fetch it every time. Chicken has carved his initials around here somewhere, and if I can find them, he'll buy me a milkshake. My sister is calling again, but she'll just have to wait a minute. Chicken Smith's bike is rusty with a wheel that rubs on the frame and no brakes. Well, that's okay because Chicken just uses his foot when he wants to slow down. My sister yells, quick, look! But I'm waiting for Chicken Smith. She can hang on. Every year, Chicken Smith and I walk to the lighthouse with sandwiches Chicken's dad makes us. You can still see where Chicken Smith wrote his whole name on the lighthouse door. We hunt for whales through Chicken's binoculars. Before it gets dark, we race each other back in time for dinner. We swim all day and sometimes Chicken Smith lets me on his dad's surfboard. Once I saw a flying fish, but Chicken says it was either a bird or my imagination. Last year, Chicken Smith gave me a piece of driftwood he had carved into a whale. So this year, I got Chicken this crazy shell from the gas station shop. My sister likes shells and things made from shells. She has a collection in a shoebox under her bed. But shells aren't as good as whales. For a start, whales can breathe through a hole in the top of their head. Shells don't. Shells just sit there and she still likes them. Maybe I should have gotten chicken a whale thing instead. Actually, if I hold this shell up to my ear, I can hear the sea and seagulls squawking. Now I can hear the ice cream truck singing. It's a different tune from last year's. What is taking Chicken Smith so long anyway? We're missing out on everything. This year, Chicken Smith's cabin looks different. The windows are shut. The grass is long and I don't see his bike. Chicken's window has a huge cobweb with a fly in it. So I leave the shell there and I walk down the beach. My sister calls again, but I'm not listening. What do you want? I call back. Just hurry up, she yells, running off along the beach. I follow her over the dune, through the trees, under the pipe where I once cut my knee, and up the hill to the lighthouse. Look, there he is, she points. And that's the first time I've seen a whale. Even with binoculars, Chicken Smith and I never saw one. My sister and I watched the whale until our eyes hurt. And then before it gets dark, I race her back in time for dinner. At our cabin, we look at my whale book until it's late. Tomorrow, we're going on a shell hunt. Chicken Smith might be here next year, or maybe the one after that. I hope so. 
and if he's not, I'll give Mary Ann his crazy shell for her collection. She'd like that. The end.